What's up guys and welcome back to Little Big Planet 2. Not that big of a video today, but I did have some fun things to show off to you guys if you're willing to listen. This week, the Little Big Planet 2 and actually Little Big Planet Karting and Little Big Planet Vita Tearaway mini pack is out. It's really cool, a very small and simple little pack. It comes with, well, two costumes. You have the a toy costume and the Iota costume. So basically, a male version and a female version. They both look really cool. There's also a sticker mini pack that I didn't pick up just because I'm not interested in it. But I thought I'd show these off along with some, uh, well, some fan-made Tearaway levels. I think they were made for the Tearaway contest a little while ago when Tearaway was actually coming out. But I thought it would be a good idea to use those levels to sort of showcase these things and sort of sit back and play some Little Big Planet as an excuse, because I haven't in a while, it's been about one to two months, but this is the Iota costume, and it looks pretty cool as you can see, I have the nice face face mask, and the green costume, even the backpack. Myself, I've only played about not much of Tearaway at all recently, or in general, just because I just haven't had the time in my life recently, I haven't had the time to sit down and do some any mobile gaming at all, really. So the first one I wanted to play was by MKL underscore 15, just called Tearaway. This one's a short, simple one, but it's still pretty cool when it comes to the visual design of them. Why don't we hop in? Okay, so um, this one, like I said, is really cool when it comes to the design. Uh, my crown is the best. Oh, yes, it is. It's a pretty nice crown you got there. But look at the design of the level. It really gives a very solid Tearaway feel. If you look at the trailers or even any type of gameplay of Tearaway, you see some very similar stuff to what you're seeing here. And we can just go around and you can see the level is already over. Here's some screeching from the river over there. I don't even want to know what's inside there. But very short, but look at the detail. I just wanted to show that off. So we get to see Iota in a little bit of action while we run around and enjoy ourselves in this little area. It looks pretty cool though, I love the design, it's very nice. Alright, so this time we're gonna take a look at a toy and see how she looks in action with the Tearaway Powerful Paper, 1-4 to four players. This one was for the Tearaway competition, it was made by Lone Wolf X 11 So why don't we hop in and check it out. And this one's really interesting. This one has a little bit more work put into it when it comes to the design, the level design. It's a little bit longer, actually has some gameplay to it. But the visual design isn't as great as the previous one. I feel like the previous one really defined what a Little Big Planet version of Tearaway would look like. This one, not as much, but still fun to play. So props to these two creators are both really great and really awesome. Um, why don't we just hop around? You can see we have these nice little bounce pads. We can see a toy here and her little bouncing action as she flips and flies through the air. I don't I really like both of the characters though. They both look very nice and happy and really feel like, you know, they were taken straight out of Tearaway. It's very cool to see. There's a lot of bubbles on this level. You could probably get some pretty rockin' high scores in this one. But it's hard to control these jump pads. They're very sharp. They'll launch you very far. Oh, see, it's very hard to keep up with that arc of bubbles, though. It's not really to scale. Then over here, whoa, Tearaway in the sky! Whoa! <laughs> I like these trees, though. These trees look interesting. They're not really what I expected the trees to look like, but they, they're interesting looking. It's like with the little branch coming straight out, and then the yellow part of the branch at the bottom. Weird looking, but I like the design. Alright, what's over here? Oh, a little squirrel on a tree. Hey, bud, step away from that tree. I think I know karate. Oh, I see. He's threatening me. Oh, gosh, it's you. Oh, yeah, watch out for enemies in the direction you're going. Pfft, they are nothing compared to these guns. I've been taking them all down. Okay, so he's a big, tough guy. Oh, there's an enemy ahead, but don't worry. It's basically worthless as long as you have something. Okay, the text goes by way too fast. Not a speed reader. Come on now. So I can just constantly throw these guys. Okay. Oh, I guess if I like throw them at each other, they'll like explode. Oh no, he blew up. Okay. <laughs> now you can see my ah, I'm on fire dance. But there you go, this level over. Another short one, but it actually had some gameplay elements to it. I thought it was overall really fun and really cool. It's <laughs> number three on the scoreboard. Look at me go. 
Okay, so that's all I have for the Tearaway Mini Pack Costume Edition thing. By the way, this is available on Little Big Planet Karting and Vita. So I bought it for Little Big Planet 2, but I also have these costumes available for me for both Karting and Vita. I won't be showing them off in this video, but I would like to thank you, yes you, for watching. If you did enjoy the video, make sure you give it a like, maybe even tell your friends, because the more you support the channel, the awesomer it is. The more I can do on the channel, the more I can show off. If you haven't subscribed, I suggest you consider it, because I'm going to be doing more awesome Little Big Planet content like this, more Little Big Planet 2 content once more DLC release along with more Little Big Planet Hub content when that actually releases. So there's tons and tons and tons of awesome things to be excited for, so hopefully you're excited for them. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys later.